Hey guys, Kurinji here. Once again, bringing you the worst start of VTuber community. And today we're back on Reddit. Finally, back on Reddit. Reddit is usually very boring when it comes to VTuber cringe stuff. But sometimes, on rare occasions, there's these little gems that pop up in places you'd least expect them. This story is one of one of those. As um, a disgruntled wife tries to um, understand his husband's hobby of watching VTubers and reposts a particular post on a lot of dating marriage advice subreddits. So let's get right into that one. My 30 female husband, 33 male, loves watching whole life slash VTubers and it bothers me. My husband loves watching these performers in YouTube called VTubers, especially the whole life group. The little background of us, we are currently in a long distance and I've always knew he likes anime. Not VTubers yet. Recently he started watching them and I feel left out of sometimes because he would share stuff about them. I am not interested that much but I do ask, ask so I would know a little about what he is talking about and also a sign of respect about his likes slash hobby. He also watches their concerts and spends money on tickets. While here I am feel left out of not receiving anything from him. Gift giving for me is part of LDR because our connections are limited, so I hope you get what I mean. Um, not really, but let's continue. Recently he said he will watch their concerts and he showed me the poster. It was a summer theme concert and what bothers me is the anime characters female in bikinis. I mean, yes, the summer theme has bikini, but the anime VTubers seem at, at a young age. Should I voice out what I feel and tell them I am creeped out? I love my husband, but this love of VTubers scares me a bit. How should I go about this? Telling him to stop watching them seems a bit much. Also demanding him to spend a little more uh, a little more for me is a bit much and I'm wrong or right. Help, I need advice. Sorry for any grammar errors, it's not my first language. Too long didn't read. He watches VTubers, it creeps me out sometimes because VTubers look, look like young people. And he also spends money on them, but not me, I feel unloved sometimes from your face. Well, uh, Mrs. Wife, as I will call you. I think this uh, says to uh, a lot of different things about you. First of all, I think there's a bit of insecurity there. I mean, instead of confronting your husband directly about it, you decided to go on Reddit of all places and repost this very weird post to a lot of people asking strangers about this. And you know, there's a lot of weird red flags here, like expecting gifts based on the long distance status of your relationship currently. I don't quite understand why that should be a thing. Like, I mean, why is gift giving in particular so important when you're long distance? Shouldn't just talking to someone be enough? I, I mean, your husband clearly is passionate about this hobby, so... What is the problem here? Is the problem here just because these VTubers that you find creepy look young to you? I mean, if you know to go on Reddit for advice, a bit of research into what your husband actually enjoys would probably be uh, you know, the next best, best thing to do. Like, what are these Hololive VTubers? Are they really underage? Or is that just their appearance that bothers you so much? Well. Let me explain this to you. This is someone that will never watch this video. These VTubers are all adults. They look what they look like. And judging an anime character's age on their appearance alone is folly. Because, you know, it's anime. It's an anime aesthetic. You can look like a whatever and be 3000 years old. And you can look like the most voluptuous supermodel and be like 15 or 14. It doesn't matter. It's all fictional, at least when it comes to their designs. But be aware, all of these performers, all of these VTubers that your husband loves so much, they are adults and they are children. And it's really just a problem of you. So once again, instead of going on Reddit, instead of asking total strangers about your husband's hobbies, do confront him about it, but not in the way you want to. Let him explain to you what these things are. Otherwise, I don't know about your relationship. You say you love him, but then you expect 
gifts from him to keep the spark going in your long distance relationship? That seems kind of weak to me. But you know, what do I know? I, I just make videos about weird VTuber stuff on the internet, so take that with a grain of salt when it comes to me. But yeah, Reddit. It's a weird place for weird people. Like the rest of the internet, I guess. But for right now, that's everything. I hope to see you on the next one.